Right, welcome back everyone to another episode. Uh, in the last one I was heading down to Marion Forks. I think that's how you pronounce that. Um, I don't know what I'm doing. Text is a bit too uh, off. It doesn't actually say, does it? It just says get there. Alright. Oh, there you go, yeah, I'm looking for a metal tube. It's basically a go find these objects type of mission. I can use this. Hey. Ooh, I'll grab the petrol. Can. That'll come in handy. Need this. Done. Find hunting blade. Am I st still in the same place, or do I have to go somewhere else? I have to go somewhere else, don't I? Or... Do I? Yeah, no, just down the road. Blade. Where am I gonna find a blade? Wait, 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 where, where was that sporting goods store? I completely missed that uh, turning off. Ah, what's that? I gotta finish burning out this infestation zone. No, I don't. Oh. You. Where are you going? I got this. Hang on. Hey, hey, it's not safe out here in the shit. I know where there's a camp. Camp? Where? 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 Oh, where? Go. go to. Ooh, yeah, go to Iron Mike's. Head to Lost Lake. Ask for Ricky Patel. She'll take you in. I, 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 was, I was done for. Bullshit! You know? Thank you so much. Oh, man. <laughs> Come back later and finish burning. Name's Deacon. They know who I am. Now just keep running. Stay off the road. Okay. Here it is. Now, I just gotta find a blade. Okay. This is it. Okay, let's see. What's going on here? There you are. Oh, shit. Wrong way. What do you mean wrong? What, what? What's going on? What am I doing? Find Boozer's... Oh, wait. What? About Boozer's arm, finding a hunting blade. What am I doing? Alright, I'm guessing someone ran off with the hunting blade. I assume. Just recently. Because we can still track them. Because that makes sense. Down you go! What's this? Okay, got a ten scrap.
Uh, I'm sure there's a garage somewhere around here. On the other side of this place. So, might be good trek in there. I think there's a garage here. Let me, no, there's not. Am I on about? <coughs> I'm thinking of somewhere completely different. Time to get back to the bike. Finding scrap might be a time-consuming process. Knowing my luck. Alright, where did I leave the bike? I left the bike around the corner, didn't I? I might have scrap in it. In either case, I'm grabbing that. Is that a hatchet or an axe? Hatchet. Uh, I'll keep the blade. Uh, I can't go in that building. Great! Let me try that one. Actually, no, cars. Cars is a, are a good source of scrap. It's all coming back to me now. Yeah, scrap. Five. Well, wow. that's pretty cool. Get in here. Oh, this ought to be enough. Hey. Now uh, I just gotta get all this crap back to Ricky. That's, uh, I hate these tunnels. How far is it to where I'm going? Oh, I hit that. Don't stop, don't stop. Now a good place to stop. Yeah, how far is it to where I'm going? Does it say? It usually does. Kind of weird that it's not coming up on the hub. Ah! 
infected wolves. Aye, God, come on. Like they're like they're hard to kill in normal mode, but they're like fucking I don't know bullet sponges in hard mode. Yeah, like a shot, I don't care uh, Jesus. if they're infected, but a shot to the head should kill these things. Kills regular infected. And I can't repair the bike. Because I've only got, I think I've only got like 10 scrap on them. And I need that for Boozer. Oh, fuck off. Not another one. Murderers, thieves, the lot of you. How many people you killed today, huh? Stop moving. Oh, the hostage is dead, isn't he? Crap. Ah, yeah. Ammo is a problem. Okay, let's try that again. Attempt, no attempt number two. Oh, what the hell? Uh, that's worth checking out. Off of crying out loud. Oh, yeah, God, they're shitting me. Uh, hey. Good night. Oh, look, there's more. Uh, I know it's night time, but this is taking the piss. See, like, these go down in one shot. Like, one shot to the head, at least. Oh, what the hell? Is this more? This is never ending. There's a swarm nearby, isn't there? It must be. Yeah, fine. Kill me. There's no, there was no, like, getting back from that. Not on the health I had. Gun's fine, though. Got enough ammo with the gun. Just health's a problem in this one. Because you can't see your health bar. And... And that's mainly it, you can't see your health bar. Be something going into a fight with full health, but most of the time you're going into a fight with like half a health bar. Okay, third time. Third time's a charm. Yeah, see what I mean? Half a health bar. There you go.
What the hell happened here? Uh, wonder if they left anything worth the effort. No, ah, I keep driving into things. Why do I keep driving into things? Okay, I keep moving the bike, and I think I moved it and stick, you know, enough so I can f so just glide past an object, and then I just hit the side. Uh, Oh, hopefully I don't do that again. Alright, don't drive into that tree. Alright, this is good. This is like the furthest I've gotten so far, I think. Hopefully I don't pack in the engine by ramming into too many of those freakers. Or run under... Actually, if I run under petrol, it's not so bad. I can just drop by that petrol station on the way to Lost Lake. It's just the, the general health of the the engine I'm worried about. Actually, I, I did get this far, didn't I, the first time. I got... Okay, petrol's okay. Health of the bike is about 40%, I'd say. 40-something. Well, definitely 40 now. I know why I'm crashing into things. I haven't had my coffee. I haven't had coffee today. Between this uh, episode and the next, I'll get a cup of coffee, don't me. I'll be fine. Driving like a pro. Out here there ain't nothing but murder and drifters. Oh, Raiders. that's the guy who got me the last time. Alright, down. Uh, 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 I don't like to do it, but I'm gonna have to leave that guy. Dear Cross, well, guess you don't have to be worried about traffic no more, do you? Well, uh, we have to worry about the freakers chasing them. Oh, later, finish burning out these nests. Oh, uh, don't tell me this. Oh, fuck off. No way. I see you running around. Hey, asshole, we can see you. Keep coming! Come on out. Stop moving. Get him. <laughs> oh, come on. I don't want to die now. I just got you. Was that it? Was that all of them? You don't need these. Please tell me it was all of them. No, 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 it wasn't. Get out, get out, get off, get off, get off, get off. Well, let's go, open up. I know him. Ah, they're all dead. Cool. Ah, well, that was... The yeah. game kind of just, like, trying to shit all over me, but, you know. I got through it. Hey, good to see you. What's going on? Hey, Deke, can I ask you something? Could I stop you, Blair? Could I? <laughs> no. I heard there was a big fight between Schizo and Iron Mike. What's going on? Do you know? I mean, I hear things like Schizo wants to take over the camp. That's messed up. Just uh, look, I don't believe everything you hear, okay? Just stay sane that way.
I got those parts that you were asked for. Oh, great. Well, uh, check back in a few. See what I can do. Yeah. Uh, Ricky. Thanks. Yeah. Boozer's one of us now. Okay, I'm still, I'm on the verge, I'm like, what, a hundred and something, away from a hundred and twenty-seven, away from, um, leveling up trust in this camp, trust level, uh, right, what am I doing, where am I going to go, go and see Ricky, I think she's got a job for me, here for your bike? Having a look. D, thank God. Ricky, what's wrong? Do you know a man named Joshua Harper? Harp? Uh, yeah, yeah, I know him. I trusted this son of a bitch. He uh, wrapped a black bandana around his head like he was <laughs> some kind of damn hipster or something. Yeah, well, your instincts are pretty spot on. He shot Dan Lane in the back over a card game and took off. Oh, Jesus, where is he now? A patrol spotted him heading south. They were too scared to even approach him. I guess he'd met up with a group of drifters. I really need your help on this one. Okay, I'll handle it. I marked where they spotted him on your map. Thanks, you. Okay, I may as well repair my bike. How's it going? Whilst hey, I remember. Going? You need your bike repair? Yeah. You really need a lot of fuel. Um, can't read but Oh, I can craft bandages. Nice. Don't know how I was able to do that now. Don't know if I picked up anything. What's this? Bony Hunter over a card game. Let's go. See you around. If I do this, I should get enough trust to level up, and then get enough to spend all the credits I got on a gun. I want that, like, SWAT 10 submachine gun. Um, see what the uh, bike parts I can get. Hey, DQ there. I've got Boozer's new prosthetic ready. I asked Addy to find him and send him over. Great. Great, Ricky. I'll, I'll be right there. Deacon out. After I get this guy, whatever, this bounty hunter. This bounty hunt. Is that the right term? I'm gonna put the volume down on my headset. Way too loud. I can barely hear myself talk. Uh, right. Not that far. There's not too many of these guys. If I throw... I got an attractor? I got an attractor. Oh, 
Well, yeah, there's a uh, spark. It, it kind of got to him before I did. Jesus. Bring back his headscarf. Dan's people want to so that Harper is dead. Go, go, find him. Yeah, okay, well, it, it might be a little bit messy. Fine. All right, sure, yes. Oh. How do you see me? Ah, oh, yeah. Prick. Should have seen that coming, in fairness. Yeah, looks like Harp and his men are heading to Camp Creek. You sure you can handle this? What do you think? Just asking. Lost Lake out. <laughs> Can you see me though? Can you see me? No. That's right. Do my job for me. they all just wander off. No guarantee of that though. Oh shit. I'm stuck here, aren't I? No. no. Hey, got it. Ah. Damn it. Am my stamina is depleted? Are oh, you, bitch? Get to the bike. Where is my bike? Uh, it's up here. Okay, got oh. it. Oh, Jesus, what a mess. All right, that was easy. Okay, head back to talk to Ricky. Get my credits updated. Get my credits and trust, I hope. I just really want that gun. 
Do I remember it being a decent gun? The AK is fine. It's not. Ah, oh, you bitch. That was an insta kill too. I think. Kill him again. Just asking. Oh, oh, for God's sakes. Okay, come on, Harp. Let's just figure this the easy way. Huh? Okay. Oh, shit. Well, go on, fellas. Uh, Jesus, what a mess. Alright, time to go. Uh, probably wouldn't take the same road as I did before. Because I don't want to be clothes lined. Yes. Okay. Head back and talk to Ricky. Get my credits updated. No, it was this was on view, wasn't it? Was there a rumble there? I'm just gonna avoid every turning off. Just go on a straight line. Just gonna load up me handing in the bounty or so gonna see the, the okay. yeah. crease there. Okay, got it. Let me secure it in, okay? There you go, that's better. Okay. Hey brother, look what oh. Ricky did. What? Made me a new toy. Oh, I was all deacon. <laughs> oh, that's he really, really cool, Boozer. Hey, uh, I could have been one of those, those yeah. three goddamn musketeers. Hungard! <laughs> you fucking <laughs> ripper. <laughs> Pretty cool. Oh, hey. Jesus. Oh. Come on. Whoa, whoa. Oh, uh, maybe this hey. wasn't that good of an idea? Yeah, maybe. Damn it. Okay.
Deke, Deke, Deke. <laughs> What's been keeping you away so long? Blair, you are looking fine today. <sighs> nice. <laughs> yep. Uh, good choice. Uh, yep. <laughs> Don't be such a stranger. Hey, how's it going, Deke? How's it going, Joe? Hey, Deke. You stay whole out there, man. You here to buy something? How's it going, Buzz? What can I get you? What else can I get you? Yeah, good part, that one. Yeah, that'll last you. That's a good piece, nice and sturdy. Sure. sure. All, right. All right. I'm here if you need me, man. Hey, Ricky. Uh, here's Tarp's bandana. <sighs> what a mess. Yep, that's what I said. Thanks, Deke. I'll let dance people know. All right. So I got a gun. Got a decent gun. Literally, I've been talking for the last like two or three minutes, but I forgot to turn the mic back on. Just something I do, basically. Um, so yeah, cool. I got a, Boss, the gun doing? I wanted. Upgraded the bike quite a bit. And it fell over. Yeah, your bike's great. Uh, yeah, fuel. Um, where was I? Suspension. Uh, nitrous isn't really a big thing for me. Yeah, your bike's looking good now. And the fork. Well, what else can I get you? What does this do? Increases the amount of damage your bike can lift. Oh. that one. Yeah, that'll last you. That's a good piece. Nice and sturdy. I'll be here if you need All right. Now look at it. Now that's later, a D. thing of hey, beauty now. You Ricky, you tell her, uh, Tell her I said get to work. Oh yeah, that's a good bike. <coughs> I like that. My first one. Okay, did not check what this mission was about. I'll soon find out. Behind the counter a small coffee drink and farewell. I'm warning the gun out too. Say John, you there? Brian. Hold on. Well, Brian, I'm sick of what one. is it? I need you to do one last job. Will you listen to what I was just saying? I'm done with one this. One more job, then I'll meet you in person, show you what I got. Forget it. Her middle name. It was Irene, right? Sarah, Irene, Whitaker. It's on her admission. One last job. One last job. I sent you the coordinates. O'Brien out. Hey. Hey. You're headed somewhere in a hurry? Yeah. You remember that Nero bastard I told you about, O'Brien? 
Well, it looks like he's got some news for me, but I gotta do one last job for him first. Yeah. Okay. You should come with me. Yeah? Nah, I... Skizzle's got me on farm duty. Feeding the world one shitty weed at a time. Fuck Skizzle, I'll drop you off right afterward. When's the last time you saw a helicopter? I'll tell him he twisted my arm. Never gets old, <laughs> does it? All right, Boozer and Beacon ride again. Where are we headed? Over toward Malakwa Lake. You know where that is? Yeah, it's just north of the Rogue Tunnel off uh, Waldo Road. So what are we doing there? The Nero Chopper's gonna be on the ground doing whatever the hell it is that they do. O'Brien wants me to see what they're up to. So, Brian, he's, uh, he's what, your shot caller? Handler? No! Jesus, Boozer, you know why the hell we're out here. Just asking. Seems like he tells you to jump, you ask how high. It's not how it is. So how you holding up? Not bad. Uh, it's been worse, you know. I actually don't mind working. Reminds me of when I was a kid. I used to go out to my uncle's farm out at uh, by Adrian on the Idaho border. I spent summers working the beet fields. They had a little dirt bike I tooled around on. That's where I learned to ride. If you're not careful, I'm gonna start calling you. When we get to that site, stay close. Whatever happens, don't let them see you. They can get a little trigger happy. Okay, okay, got it. Stay down, keep my mouth shut, don't get us killed. Hey, thanks for bringing me along, Deke. It's good to get out again. Even riding bitch, you know? <laughs> yeah. Okay, stay close. I need the right back here. Jesus. Come on, folks, let's get this one out. Standing by. <laughs> All right, now watch. Soldiers come out first, they secure the LZ. Then their boy genius, researcher, scientist, whatever the hell, he comes out, he looks around. Do what? Whatever science shit they're doing out here, how the hell would I know? The one who's been spying on Yeah, no wonder they haven't done much. Wait here. All they do is have like one scientist roam around, talk things. Make some sort of observations and then just leave. Who's locking these doors? Known as miners' lettuce. Please don't interrupt. As well as malicious berries from Jennifer. 
numerous communists. So why do we care? Why do we care? Because it means the freedom. Oh, I can't follow them, can I? Oh you Ah, oh, I, like I couldn't get. I probably couldn't get closer outside. <coughs> All right, let's tr try, shall we? Hey, let me know when the LC's locked down. Come on, folks, let's get this locked down. <coughs> let me know when it's clear. Ah, nah. Okay, let's try again. Okay, walk away. Can I? Yas. Yas, hey, I can. What you got there, Doc? Really? <laughs> okay, if you must know, we're picking up scat samples. <laughs> you mean shit? Yes. Freak shit? Yes. <laughs> so, we're out here in the middle of nowhere. So, you can pick up freak shit. Precisely. <laughs> okay. Enough said. Field note 2102. After analysis of scat samples from zones 2, 3, and 4B, there is clear evidence of Claytonia perfoliata. What's that? Commonly known as miner's lettuce. Please don't interrupt. As well as manicious berries from Juniperus communis. So, why do we care? Why do we care? Because it means the freaks are eating more than just us and each other. <laughs> They're eating berries, plants, grass, needles, basically anything a deer would eat. They're omnivores just like us, but with stomachs that can digest a much wider range of cellulose. Yeah, okay. And um, what? It means they're not gonna starve when they run out of us to eat. <laughs> Freaks aren't going away anytime soon. Shit, that's bad. Yeah, that's bad. Back to the bike. I can score around this, all these guys, can't I? Catch any of that over my radio? That's pretty fucked up. Good taxpayer money and they're out here collecting freaker shit. Yeah, I told you. Who knows what they're doing or why? Oh, they gotta have a base around here somewhere, right? You try following them? Yeah, but they always disappear over the mountains heading south. And with the highway choked off, I can never get close. Sons of bitches. Seems like they got a lot to answer for. Yeah. Where are we headed now? It's a good question. O'Brien, are you there? Come in, O'Brien. I'm here. Finished? Yeah, it's done. Where am I meeting you? I wasn't expecting you so soon. I'm sending you the coordinates now, but it might take a few minutes to get there. O'Brien out. Jesus, what the hell does he think I've been doing out here? Hey, you're right about one thing. He does sound like an asshole.
wait here. I don't want him getting skittish because I brought someone along. Yeah, I'll keep an eye on the bike. I've seen enough Nero assholes for one day. All okay, right, I'll turn the mic off. Brian said he had news for this bit. Knew her middle name, Irene. She can't be alive, but he's alive. Why not her? Huh? There he is. Yo. Shit. Gotta stop doing that. What you got? All right, look. I'm gonna lay it out for you, but it's not good news. I finally found a guy who was willing to do some digging through some files that we, they, they used to keep while they still kept records. Okay, no problem. Anyway, uh, Sarah Whitaker, your wife, was in, admitted to the Camp Mash unit on the South Flats outside of Silver Lake. Uh, according to the records, she was in surgery for six hours and then was moved okay, to... So she survived. The stab one, she survived. Yeah, uh, yeah. According to the records, she made a full recovery. And then she was moved to another camp on the outskirts okay, of the Okay, so, so she could still be alive. Even after all this time, she could still be alive, you're saying? No. What do you mean, no? It was overrun. Everything was overrun. There were no survivors. You survived. They survived. Look, 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 look. There was nothing that would have protected that camp, okay? Highway 97 w w is an artery. Infected freaks poured up from L.A., from the Bay Area, from Sacramento. There were thousands and thousands and thousands of them. There was, there was nothing we could do. I get it. So you bugged out. Who did you bring with you? Uh, Nero personnel. Some feds. People with clearance. Nero personnel. The soldiers. The guys with the guns. The guys that should have been protecting no, no, the there's civilians. There's nothing that you can do against a horde. Oh, They're no, too strong. I know all They're too about fast. hordes. Oh, I didn't know that there was nothing that we could do. Oh, you know what you could have done? You could have brought a few of them with you. You could have saved a few lives. There was no hope. There was no time. There was no room. Okay, we had already turned on each other by the time the hordes arrived. No, I get it. I'm sorry about your wife. I'm sorry about all of this. But you gotta understand. If you hadn't sent her with me that night, she would have been dead the next morning. You did the right thing. You know, if you had decided to stay, the only thing that would have happened is you'd be dead right alongside her. Don't you think I know that? O'Brien. Thank you for saving her life that night. Actually, the alarm just went off on my timer, so I think I've about to hit the hour mark. So you're sorry. I'll carry on from here in the next video. Thank you all for watching. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and just have a good day. Nothing too long with this uh, outro. Yeah, just have a good day.